Hello and welcome to Baki Gaming and this is the Sims 4 tutorial in which I'm going to show you how to disable fading on objects. The program you will need to do this is the Sims 4 Studio. In lift mode there are some objects that will disappear when you come too close with your camera. One example of this is this cherry blossom tree. From this distance you will see it, but when zooming in it will suddenly disappear. A way to solve this is using the cameraman mode by hitting the tap key. A disadvantage of this is that you can't control your sims anymore. To fix all of this first open the sims for studio. Fill in your creator name if you haven't already done so and then go to the object section. Select override if you want to change the fading on all cherry blossom trees in game. Select standalone if you want to change it on only one tree. After that click the object button. Now go to the search bar and type in 657E for the cherry blossom tree to appear. Select it and click on next. Now give it a name and click on save to make it into its own package file. Now to change the object's fading you can go straight to the warehouse right here. Although you can change the name, description and price too if you want. After you clicked the warehouse tab right here, search for a line called model. Then Click that line and go to data right here. Then search for a line called U3 and change its number into a zero. As that's all you need to do, save your package file and place it into your mods folder to test it out in game. To easily find our new object type a part of the name, in this case cherry, into the search bar. As you can see I made a custom thumbnail for it too. A tutorial about how to easily do this will be made soon and added to the video's description. After placing my tree and zooming in you will see that it won't fade away anymore. This tutorial is part of my 1000 subscriber special together with 3 other tutorials and one custom content video. If you like it please give it a thumbs up and share it so more people will be able to find it. If you got any questions just leave them in the comments down below. Don't want to miss any future tutorials, custom content videos or effect player episodes, then please subscribe and hope to see you next time here on Baggy Gaming.